16% win percentage here for ZD does not bode well, but Wadi leading off with the... <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is... <laughs> he is firing a shot off of the bow here. ZD has actually lost to this character rather frequently, and it has a good matchup against Fox, so I have to see <laughs> if one of Wadi's pockets can take down perhaps ZD's main no, at this point. Oh, not the ice climbers to start. Oh, my God, uh, Wadi. You've got to... You're trolling, right? You're a lot trolling. of Fox players hate this matchup, so I'll give him that. It, it is a solid matchup what? pick, but I don't know how much he has been playing this Icy's, but right well, now he's actually. looking like he is a little bit prepared. Yeah, he definitely knows how to abuse Fox in, in advantage. Right, that's that's Fundy's, mm -hmm. <laughs> if anything, right there. Fundy's can really carry you against Fox, who uh, wants to be catching you in all of the wrong panic options. Oh, that iceberg. Still, I love this. Wadi is actually, you know, catching some of these good stuff, but you're going to still die. <laughs> yeah, he gets a two for two. One yeah. up smash to claim both characters right there, so no opportunity for Nana to go ahead and seek a revenge kill. Right. Why does it need some of these uh, these big call-outs? And unfortunately, uh, the lead ends with, uh, with Ice Climbers. Wazidi's doing a good job of separating the two mm -hmm. so that he's not able to get these, like, follow-ups uh, with both hits. So that's been a really good knowledge check for ZD so far. Uh, I want to see how Wadi kind of adapts to that because uh, he's still getting these straight hits. They're just not counting as much as they normally would. In addition, like, when you are able to hit both Ice Climbers, it's so beneficial for you because it, the way it used to work, yeah. and I believe it how it works still, is that Nana has a damage multiplier where she takes some of Popo's damage too. Oh, okay, okay. So basically, like, you, she has her own damage gauge that you just don't see. So that's why yeah. she gets knocked away so much harder than right. Popo because she's been smacked and she has to deal with, like, I think it was, like, 30 or to 60 percent of Popo's Ooh. damage. Oh yeah, but right now Sopo is not going to cut it, unfortunately, in most of these situations. you got to be really lucky and catch ZD off guard. You, so you far calling you're out my man Sopo? So, so, so far, you're so far so good. I mean, but Sopo is going to be uh, a little bit lacking right now. ZD getting caught by everything, though. The, the hammer is doing work. Yeah, I mean, you, you, you talk in a lot of nonsense about this man Sopo when he is putting in that work all of a sudden. It's not quite drawing even yet, but he is putting in a lot of damage here on this Fox. It feels like that up air is like low-key one. One of the best in the game. Yeah. It, it covers just so much space, and when you've got two, twice yeah. is nice. I mean, for sure, for sure. Twice is nice, but the ice is not enough here. And I, I don't know. Right now, you're still getting caught by these side. Yep, that's the <laughs> that's the pseudo Tatsu that you're going to get caught in. Uh, and ZD going to be very, uh, very prompt with taking advantage there. Now, he's just got to kind of play a more patient game. You don't really need to go in, but he is opting to do so, and that, to his detriment, is now leading to Wadi bringing it to last The time. second you say he doesn't need to do it, he doesn't die for it. I know, I know. You listen to me, man. <laughs> it's, like, it's almost like us commentators know a few of these well, maybe you do. <laughs> maybe you do. Uh, Uh-oh, getting caught by this stuff on site? Okay, we got to be very, very cautious here because ZD! <laughs> he almost got that fair. That was... Yeah. Yep, that yep, would have yep. been a one way to end the match with an exclamation point. Not going to get that shine spike either. Can't separate them. That get lets Wadi get back to stage for a free with a side B. Yeah. Blizzard is out. And very smart by ZD to just back off and take those lasers. Yeah. The getup attacks him off stage, so it has to go low. Can't get the, the two frame. Wadi is so good at micromanaging Nana. I've actually never, like, holy cow. Like, he's actually really good at, like, controlling Nana whenever Popo's, like, in distance. Like, oh, just smack him out of here. Oh, my God. Wadi with the game off ZD with the Ice Climbers. You know what? I've been wrong before. It's not often. This is a little bit uh, uh, awkward because it's it's Ice Climbers. Like, I mean, I would have never expected it, but ZD is getting caught by stuff. And you did mention that the matchup is... is it, the matchup isn't different. great, yeah. and ZD has lost to this character a couple times before. Yeah. And it's 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 typically just the problem. It, you cannot do Fox things against this character. Mm -hmm. You can't approach with Nair, actually. Because the up tilt and the up air are just too good. Yeah. In addition... If you want to go ahead and approach from like a 45 degree angle, you're going to yeah. have to deal with Blizzard. Yeah, that's and true. then also it's got the burst option of the side B. So it's mm. so hard to just like run in on this character. But we're sticking with it. No switch over yeah. to the wolf. Interesting. Yeah, I mean, I guess now that I'm kind of looking at it, it's like Ice Climber's aerials kind of remind me of like Steve. Like the up tilt and the up air being so good. Mm -hmm. Like very Steve-esque. Yeah, I, I definitely see it. I think it's it's the better it's a better disjoint and it's more lingering because there's two of them. Yeah. So if anything, it's actually better Ooh, than Steve's. For, uh, oh, okay. What happened? Nana decided that she didn't want to play the game no more. I guess so. Occasionally, it's a two v one. Uh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> and it's yeah. not in Ice Climber's favor. Yeah, okay, yeah occasionally <laughs> Nana jumps ship and uh, it goes a little bit uh, tailcoat. I don't know. I'm wondering because now he's got the dis oh D sinks. 
desyncs are got online. Those? Okay, Wadi. I, I mean, he didn't get too many of those in uh, in game one, but now it looks like we got a few of these uh, Ice Climber ATs. The tech is out. Right, and even then, getting these juggles, really, really nice stuff. Um, I mean, I think Wadi's looking very, very strong in these advantage situations, but um, in the neutral, he sometimes struggles and in disadvantage, like, honestly. Well, this sometimes. character doesn't have neutral. Yeah, well, yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. That's the like, the, basically, the character's neutral is, like, side B and down B. Like, it's... <laughs> It's like I can spin on him Did and I, I can him? toss out projectiles, but that's that's about it. All right, if I didn't hit him, I keep mashing a little bit. Okay, and so far this is looking pretty good. Wadi uh, putting ZD a bit in the blender. ZD does not know how to react in this situation. I mean, that side B is, excuse me, the, the uh, it's it's just so difficult to actually get a punish on either the side B or the right. down B because of the angles at which Wadi can like choose to like pop it up right True. there. Trying Especially when he has the disjoints mm, going. Trying to take the opportunity to put a little punishment on Nana, but uh, uh, ZD. Not able to close the gap there just yet. And unable to land on them at all in ZD. He has to stay grounded, and the problem is if you stay grounded, Ooh. you have to hit Popo, because if you hit Nana away, Wadi's going to take the opportunity to punish hard. Uh-oh, no two-frame, though. Uh, looking all right for ZD, able to get back in, and this looks like a potential follow-up, but uh, he just opts to go, go for Nana, and I'm wondering. There, actually, a good call out from Wadi. Uh, yeah, I think ZD wasn't really sure what to do in that moment. He kind of like, his mind was going two places at once. I mean, considering the fact that he's facing a 2v1 at this point, he exactly. might have to go ahead and think double. Yeah. Yeah, and that's the challenge that this character presents right now. ZD looking like he's willing to stand up to the challenge. Oh, he didn't go for the sister. At that point, you got to go ahead and make Nana pay for it. You, yeah. The second that they're isolated, I really do think that you should just hound in on the CPU because that is a sitting duck. Oh no, but right now, the only sitting duck is Wadi on the platform. Very nice stuff from ZD looking to take Nana out of the equation entirely. Uh, you see how little lag there is on that side B, though? I know. It, yeah. It's so hard to whip punish, and especially when there's two of them. When there's two yeah. of them, it, it basically is that one of them ends first, and then Nana ends second. Right. So because of that, it, Popo is basically safe for it. Okay, but Wadi, I mean, we've seen some good stuff with the Ice Climbers, but we have yet to see some of like the big stuff, right? Like the huge combos that we that we know uh, could be potential with this character. Wadi doesn't really lab too much. Yeah, so. We haven't seen the big D combos. We what? do see that big hammer instead. Misdirection. You're thinking about Nana while uh, Popo is safe. Sending that hammer right in the old noggin. That's one of those where you just DI down and say, I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to flick the C stick until something bad happens to my opponent. It's like, that's right, I'm going to peace out and then fade into it. <laughs> non fade you out instead. Fade, yeah, exactly. At that point, um, I do not know what the play here is. He's sticking with the Fox. We're probably going to run it back. I assume the same stage. That was too quick. Wadi, these Ice Climbers have been putting the work to ZD. Yeah, I am super surprised by this. I haven't seen this in tournament. Yeah. Have you had a curiosity? I've seen a little bit of it on his stream, like some of yeah. his stream clips and highlights. But but never in bracket. Not before. in bracket. And, I mean, it might have been in Richmond. Honestly, this last this last Richmond uh, local might have been uh, an opportunity for him to try this this uh, Ice Climbers out. So maybe I'll check that for it. Um, but, yeah, this seems like it kind of comes out of nowhere. But I know that there has been rumblings of this. And also, Wadi has just a solid, stable of character. So you have to be prepared yeah. for just about anybody in the cast when for fighting sure. this man. Exactly. Didn't he win a cave with Puff? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he won a cave with Puff. <laughs> um, much to my chagrin. Um, and hey, you know, we're going to be able to get this uh, th this Nana out of here. ZD off to a good start here in game number three. Uh, he's definitely not out of this just yet. I want to see where this goes. Uh, but Wadi, again, the, the... Look at how safe these things are. He just I taps ZD's shield. ZD tries to up smash out of shield, and Wadi's like, nah, I got more it's hitboxes. Like, this is Sopo. Why is Sopo doing so much pressure? But ZD able to take the first stock. That's what you're looking for. This is a great start. Yeah, now ZD can actually play defensive, and that's, I think, what you need to do in this matchup is that Ice Climbers are only good when you have to fight them. Yeah, but even then, when he did have that lead in the last game, he still went to on the offense. Yeah, yeah, he can pick his spots a little bit more intelligently here. Like that's You don't have to just rush in and get opened right. up by them. Has no, to go low, not going to get two frame, but is going to get sent off at an awkward angle. And so f Wadi has not been able to hit that down tilt two frame once so far. Yeah, still looking for it though. Now forcing out the Firefox. Still not able to get anything. He's beating. He's beaten back by the uh, the upbeat. Now the air dodge. I don't. Yeah. yeah, the air dodge was, I would think, errant. At this point, both ice climbers 
desynced and threatened. That's exactly what you want to see, but no, Wadi able to get back to center stage to the side B, giving him a little bit of an opportunity to claim space perhaps. And But ZD actually manages to intercept wow. the mana. That was so difficult. Oh yeah, ZD is just picking them apart and then going for some of this nice stuff. And the Nana just doesn't want to play. She's just stuck in that platform right. doing the little uh, two-step. Nana has lost the will to live completely, it looks like. They uh, just get stuck on the platform and just like, I don't want to yeah. play the game no more. Exactly, I'm out, I'm out. This is not fair. Uh, ZD going to benefit so well, um, taking Nana out yet again. I think since he's been taking that on as his uh, his MO, it's been very, very smart. Mm -hmm. Just punish the sister. Yeah. Let Popo survive. Let the man thrive. Yeah. Just just get go for support angle. Yeah, pretty much. And at this point, uh, Wadi is not able to do enough uh, but delay, right, with the, with the Sopo. So even then... You know, you're still down the full stock. ZD has kept this comfortable lead uh, for the entire game now. Uh, and this has been very, very strong, but Wadi needs one good edge guard. So far, he has yet to get something like that. And the second you say Finally it, we the get second it. you say it, he goes off stage with a fair, a phenomenal yeah. play right there from Wadi, threatening to draw this not just even, but take a lead here. But the, no, ZD gets out of the combo and tries to start one of his own up. Can't land with the dash tag, and the Blizzard is out. Got to be careful of that shield pressure starting to mount. Now you're kind of forcing ZD back to ledge. ZD not able to really put up too much of a fight. These out of shield options have been very good for Wadi. So far, so good indeed. But right now, Nana hit off stage, but just teleports into yep. the squall hammer right there. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the fade back actually forces ZD into uh, a quick option uh, without. Oh being no, prepared. Nana! Not Gotta like be this. Careful. Okay, okay, goes down, goes down. You have so much to live for, I please. I know, literally, Nana, like, all right, I'm out. I'll see you later. <laughs> exactly. I put, in my me, eight, right? I put in my eight hours. I don't need no more, right? right I'm clocking oh, out, Oh, no. Oh, my God, no. ZD is the one clocking out with a 